Da, 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 da. That's good, right there. Remember, put your foot to the ground. Just walk back, kick out, put your foot to the ground. On the ball of your foot, move from the elbow. It had to be a little daunting the first time the track and field athletes at Oaks Christian met their new coach last year. Can you imagine being in high school and being trained by one of the greatest athletes in the world? Maurice Green is a track and field icon. The Olympic gold medalist and five-time world champion is one of the most decorated sprinters in U.S. history. So his hiring as a sprint coach at Oaks last year made quite an impression. He's one of the best in the world, and just the fact that he's able to coach us. So, I mean, that's a great inspiration for us, knowing what he can do for us. It's just going to keep us motivated, try to be the best, and try to get him to accomplish coaching, like, as what he did when he was running. If I can help the kids around the world get better in some sort of way, or, you know, change their life, or change their path and what they're going, in, in the direction that they're going, uh, into a better direction, I mean, I, I feel good about that. The former world record holder in the 100 meter dash is now in his second season at Oaks and is changing lives in the lion's den. When he was first hired, he vowed to make an effort to recruit football players to the track. Last season, four members of the varsity football team bloomed in the spring under Green's guidance and brought home the school's first 4x100 meter relay state title with a blistering time of 41.19 seconds. We just knew we were going to come out, come out height, come out strong and we knew something special was going to happen. I told, I told him, Terry, if he gives it to me in front, we're going to win the race. Oaks Christian was out very quickly. Oaks Christian again, first to exchange into the third leg, coming into the fourth leg. Looks like Oaks Christian, yes. It almost brought tears to my eyes when they finally won. I mean, I believed that they could and I told them that they could, but when they actually did it, it, it almost brought tears to my eyes. And just to see how my team competed at state last year, they was trying to all get me to cry afterwards, but I, I wouldn't. I wouldn't give it to him. After a successful career, Green's focus has now shifted to teaching young athletes what he's learned over the years, not only at Oaks, but also here at the Elite Factory. It's a performance center that lures in top-notch athletes. These are all of the players that have been here working out. Then we have our football field where we do a little bit of agility for our soccer players, our football players, basketball players, we all do this. And then we have a little part of here on the track. It's not as long, but it gives the football players everything what they want. It's good to come here as a high school athlete because we teach specific things. We teach you how to lift correctly. We do a lot of prevention from getting hurt. Um, we help them get stronger and faster. That's the factory. You come here, we won't make you, we'll just make you better.